so this is infected. There's a small abscess here, and it's along the side of the nail, and there's a name for that. It's called a perinichia. Okay? Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to open that up, drain it for you, and put you on some antibiotics. Okay, sounds good. These are fairly common. This is an, uh, a common uh, office procedure that we might do or that any uh, primary care physician might do or I should say primary care provider because uh, well within the scope of what a nurse practitioner or a uh, PA physician's assistant might do as well. Um, so right now I'm applying pressure along the lateral aspect of the thumb, both sides, okay? And so I'm giving you a little mechanical anesthesia here. So I'm glad you came in. We've got a number 11 here, right? So Gubby Jane, why don't you spray a little, there it is, right there. And we're gonna open that up right now. Might feel a little bit there. Yeah. Well, we got yep. definitely, oh my lord. Yeah, but it's not coming where I want it to. Do a little bit more cold spray for me. Just keep spraying, keep spraying. There we go. Now we should get it to come out there where I want. There we go. There it goes. Oh. A little squeeze. Now what you'll do is you'll do some warm compresses and some soaks on this. Okay. And let this, we want this to remain open, okay? So it'll go ahead and continue to drain. Okay. And of course we're gonna put you on antibiotics. Okay. And uh, no need to worry about a blood culture or, or a, uh, in a wound culture on this. This is a simple kind of uh, localized staph infection and I'm not worried that uh, we need to worry about okay. any more than that. So Gumby Jean will dress it up here. Uh, don't put any ointments on this, okay? If you put ointments on it, you'll block up the opening that we just created and uh -oh. it can actually re-abscess. It'll start swelling back up again. So we just want to do a dry dressing on it and it'll soak, it'll drain. Okay and then you'll soak it in uh, some warm water a couple of times a day and the antibiotics will clear it up for you. Okay. If any more trouble, you're gonna let me know, right? Yes, I will. All right, Catfish Charlie, thanks for letting us video this uh, for all our friends and uh, on YouTube, okay? Okay, well, thank, right. you. thank, thank you, you, doctor. You're welcome. Stay tuned for the Meta7 video. I took mine, how about you? Coconut loves Meta7, okay? Why? Because look, I could not get comfortable for anything last night. I went to sleep at one o'clock this morning woke myself up around five and I have been knocking patients out all day non-stop and I still have a whole mess of energy. Thank you Dr. Gilmore for making Meta7. Okay, so you took Meta7 this morning. Yeah, I take it every just, morning. You take it every morning. And so even though you had a hard time sleeping last night, you took Meta7 this morning and now you are a medical assistant machine. I am a machine, I'm a tank. <laughs>